That would probably have to be Water Fountain. Water Fountain. I just like how different it is compared to all the others. It's a lot more, I guess you could say, urban. It's not classical, it's not very formal. It's really fun to sing. You're able to do the groove by yourself, and the tone is basically just very happy. My favorite APAC song is Zadok, which we played with the choir, and I just like the combination. I learned how to stagger breathe, like Miss Eidecker's taught us how to like take breaths, not at the end of phrases, but in the middle, like sneak a breath in, so it's not that obvious. I've learned that music isn't just about playing the right rhythms or playing the right notes. It's really about getting the right emotion across. So in our rehearsals, we focused a lot on dynamics and articulations, and this is kind of a new perspective that I've gained through APAC Orchestra. Music, especially singing, is a way of conveying emotions through text. Normal music can make you feel things, but singing can make you understand what you're feeling. I think music definitely builds a sense of community. Like when um, I've noticed that when I'm playing with my fellow violas, I instantly feel like a connection with them, and it's very easy to just start conversations and make friends with them through music. I think people, when they're producing music, for example, they're singing, they reveal their other side of themselves that they don't really show in their daily lives. And some people, like Joanne in there, she's pretty quiet normally, but when she's in choir, I think she's really happy and how she can express her herself. and more the power of singing and how it can be used to bridge people and sort of bring emotions to the forefront of our minds. The importance of teamwork, I guess, it's like very cliche, but I think it's really important that everybody practices their part perfectly so then when we come together and rehearse, it's more efficient and it's just we sound a lot better. <laughs> 